What is up guys? So today I was thinking a lot about uh, certain things that I'm gonna go into into this video and um, I was thinking about this question that has been coming to my mind uh, ever so often ever since uh, you know years now you know this question would keep popping up in my head and that question is if you could have cheese what would it be? And I've been trying to figure out what exactly this means and, and what answers would I pose to this question. And um, it's, it's hard to, you kind of have to tackle it. You kind of have to break it down. You kind of have to break down the question. It's very, it's not really as simple as just taking it from face value. You have to break it down and so, so, let, so basically, let me say this. If you were in a building, right, and it started to collapse, what would you do? You would uh, try to run out of it. You would uh, try to maybe, uh, I don't know, you'd be panicking, right? You'd be panicking. You wouldn't even know what to do because you would be in this panic mode. So you wouldn't be thinking rationally. And that's kind of how I tackle this question, to be honest. Because... I mean, let me answer it in, let me answer this question in the form of another question. If you could have cheese, <laughs> what would it be? And that question is even harder to tackle because, I mean, first of all, you have to break it down. You can't take it at face value, right? So let's think about it like this, right? Let me give you another example, another real world example. This is something that everyone faces every day. What if you're in the what if you're shopping, right? You're shopping for groceries. And uh, you're looking at the the brands, the prices. Now a lot of people want to go for the cheapest one, and then some people want to go for the brands that they know are good. Uh, sometimes the cheapest isn't the best, and that's true for a lot of the things in the grocery store and in giant and life in general. And um, because of that, people tend to, well, you know, if they're on a budget, they'll buy the cheaper one. But if they're, you know, living lavishly, they got more money, they're a little bit more, a little bit more uh, well to do with themselves, then they'll get the uh, nice brand, the nice, the nice product that's going to give them, you know, some good stuff. And uh, so basically, what I mean is, well, let me answer this. <laughs> let me ask. Let me ask. <laughs> let, me ask let, let me ask this question with another question. If you could have cheese, right? What would it be? What would it be? It keeps coming down to what would it be. That, that's that's what that's what really what really gets to me. It's like what would it be? And and it's I don't know I've been thinking about this for a long time like as as you can see I've been I'm, I'm just like shh. I mean I'm ruminating on it I'm I'm ruminating on it I I got like I got like what would it be OCD you know you know what would it W W I B O C D whatever the fuck it, I got that disorder um, what would it cheese what would it be o, O C D <laughs> uh, and um, I've been thinking about it a lot. I just can't stop thinking about it. Like every day, every night, every second. Like, it's, and that's why I'm making this video. It's trying to get some of my OCD out because, because that's how you cure OCD. You just make a YouTube video. <laughs> and uh, but, but, like, like I was saying, like, well, what do you guys think? I'm gonna ask you a question to end this video. To conclude this video, I'm gonna ask you a question. If you could have cheese, what would it be?